This video is brought to you by Ustadi Academy and we are continually speaking about Amr ibn al-As life. Let's talk about early life and military career. His early life, he was born in 573 and his father was a very wealthy landowner from the Banu Sah clan of the Quraysh tribe of Mecca. Following the death of al in 622, Amr of course inherited from his father the lucrative lands, the states, and vineyards near Ta'if. Amr's mother was Ilna Bira bint Harmala from the Banu Jalan clan of the Naza tribe. She had been taken captive and sold in succession to several members of the Quraysh, one of whom was Amr's father. As such, Amr had two maternal half-brothers, Amr ibn Atatha of the Banu Adi clan and Uqba ibn Nafa of the Banu Fihr and a half-sister from the Banu Abd Shams clan. Amr is physically described in the traditional sources as being short, with broad shoulders, having a large head with a wide forehead and wide mouth, long arms and long beard. There are conflicting reports about when Amr embraced the religion of Islam when the most credible virgin placed in it in 629-630, not long before the conquest of Mecca by Muhammad. According to this account, he converted alongside the Quraishites, Khalid ibn al-Walid and Uthman ibn Talha. According to Amr's own testimony transmitted by his fourth generation descendant, Amr ibn Shu'ib, he converted in Aksum, in the presence of the king, Amr uh, Arma, and met Muhammad in Medina upon the latter's re return from the Battle of Khaybar in 628. Amr conditioned his conversion on the forgiveness of his past sins and an active part in affairs, according to a report cited by the historian Ibn Asakin. Indeed, in October 629, Amr was tasked by Muhammad with leading the raid on Dahat al Salasail, uh, li uh, likely located in the northern Hijaz, the western Arabia. A lucrative opportunity for Amr in view of the potential war spoils. The purpose of the raid is unclear yet. The modern historian Fred Donner, he said he stated that it was to break up a gathering of hostile tripod groups. The tripod groups targeted in the raid included the Qada in general and Bali specifically. Umr's paternal grandmom or grandmother hailed from the Bali and this may have motivated his appointment to the command by Muhammad as Umr was instructed to recruit tribesmen from the Bali and the other Qada tribes. Following the raid, a delegation of the Bali embraced Islam further, consecrated ties with the tribe by marrying a Bali woman with whom he had his son Muhammad. Muhammad appointed Amr the governor of Oman and he remained there until being informed of Muhammad's death in 632. The death of Muhammad prom promoted several Arab tribes to defect from the Medina-based Muslim pol polity and the Ridda Wars Muhammad's successor Caliph Abu Bakr 
appointed Amr to reign in the upstate Qadaha tribes. Among those targeted were the Hijazi branches of the Bali. Amr's, Amr's um, campaigns, which were supported by the commander Ibn Hasana, or Ibn Hasna, succeeded in restoring Medina's authority as far as the northern of Syria.